Hi, this is Jaswin Valia from Team Learn Today. And in this video, we're going to add a new post to our WordPress website. Adding a new post to our WordPress website allows us to tell the world about what kind of services and projects that we are offering. Knowing how to do this will allow you to create great content for your site, which will increase its ranking in search engines and the amount of traffic your site receives. Posts are listed in reverse chronological order. That means that the most recent post is at the top and the oldest one is at the bottom. Posts can be sorted into different categories and tags so that they are easier to find by your site visitors and search engines. So let's go ahead and get into the video and see how we can add a new post to our WordPress website. The first step into creating a new post for our WordPress website would be to log into our WordPress dashboard. So I will just log into justminwalia.com slash WP admin. And as soon as we land into our WordPress dashboard, in the left sidebar, you just have to hover your cursor over posts and you will find add new as an option. Once we click on that, we will be redirected to an editor page. So as soon as we land on our post editor page, we first of all have to decide the title of our post that we're going to publish. So for the purpose of this video, the title for my post would just be a simple sample post. And of course, as soon as you click here, you have to type the content of your post, um, which would be the body that you will be publishing for your post right there. So I will just write this is a post, but of course your um, content will be much longer than this. You can go ahead and you can edit the body as well. You can make it bold, you can make it italic, and there are several options that you can explore. Once you have done that, if you want to give a preview or take a look at how this post might look like in your website, you can hit on preview right here. You can decide whether you want to look at a desktop, a tablet, or a mobile. So I will just open a desktop preview in a new tab. So once the preview has been generated, you will be able to take a look at how your post title and your post body or your content would look like once you have published this. And once you're happy with it, you can just go ahead and publish your post. I will click on view post from here and there you go. We have added a new post on our WordPress website. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed that video. In our next SOP, we're going to learn how you can remove or delete a page permanently from your WordPress website. So stay tuned for that. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button for Learn Today channel along with the bell icon so that you can get updates on whenever we come up with new videos. This is Jaswin Valia and I will see you in our next SOP.